Hey guys, it's Aloy. Um, still working away on videos for you. Um, I've been accumulating fun things. Uh, I got this wonderful little kit from um, Predator Hunter Outdoors. Um, they're night sniper hunting lights. Because yes, I do hunt. Um, I have bows and guns and all of the above. And I know some of you don't agree with that, um, but where I live, it's it's completely relevant. We have um, an abundance of reasons to hunt. I have farm animals, so I do have to take care of nuisances and stuff like that. Um, I have no qualms with it. I know that I'm sure a lot of you are going to argue with me about this. So don't get too mad, please. It's silly. We all have our own opinions. So let's check out all of this stuff. Um, very, very cool packaging. Um, has some information on the front. Um, it mounts to your scope or firearms. Um, interchangeable color LEDs, uh, green, red, and white. Operational, op tongue -tied. Operational at temps down to negative 45, rechargeable lithium ion batteries, and industrial leading warranty. Ooh, fun. Um, so let's open this box. Oh, actually, I also got a shirt from them. Their shirts are actually really, really soft and seem to be really good quality. Shirt. Um, v neck, women's cut. Yes. A hunting company with women's cut clothing. Way cool. So we're going to put this on real quick. Just because. Why do a video about their products without wearing their clothing? So. I like how this fits a lot and it's really soft. I like soft clothes. I walk around feeling things in the store all the time. Um, my cat just jumped up here again. So if he interrupts us, I apologize. Back to opening this. Sorry, sorry for the delay. So, ooh, um, super nice inside. Everything's all custom cut. Um, I know that they actually do custom kits for everything. Um, so check out their stuff. Um, contact them if you need help. Cat. Um, so let's check all of this out. Um, it comes with chargers for their batteries. And it comes with batteries for everything. Um, so I have batteries for all of the lights, which is awesome because they appear to be um, a different type of battery than what you'd see standard. Um, it also has all of their logoing and stuff on it. Um, so it seems like they have pretty good quality and like to, you know, keep control of their products. Pushing my cat off of things. Um, Where was I? Oh, so chargers for inside use. It also has a car adapter charger because um, I know a lot of us don't hunt at our homes or plan on going elsewhere. So there are options to charging them with car chargers. Um, scope mount for mounting your lights to your scope. There's also pieces in here for both the bow light and the gun light for mounting it to things and then having a separate little clicker button. Can you hear a click? Um, clicker button to um, click it from elsewhere. So like if you have it mounted to your um, bow because the light actually mounts to um, your stabilizer on your bow. If you have it mounted to your bow, you don't have to click it off the stabilizer. You can actually connect it and then click it later, um, which I will show you in two seconds. Um, I think, yeah, this one um, says Razorback on it. That is for the bow. Um, it is still part of their Night Snipe line, but they do label it differently. Um, let's see. So, so that way you can mount it to your stabilizer and then actually click it from um, elsewhere. And then the other one does, you know, has the same option, or you can use the scope mount and mount it from your scope, depending on how your setup on your gun is. I prefer iron sights, but 
scopes are needed sometimes, unfortunately. I will go ahead and put batteries in these real quick so that way you can kind of see how bright they are. Make sure I'm putting the batteries in the right way and I'm not being absolutely retarded. Batteries are a tricky thing, I'm sorry. Screw, screw, screw. Okay, so this one is green. It's kind of difficult to see with the lights on. Um, but they have a pretty solid beam, um, and they're really, really bright. It's actually hard to see how bright this is. Um, in a lit room. I figure I'll do a, another video on them um, and let you know what I think quality wise um, as far as distance and stuff like that. Um, according to the information on the website, they do have 200 yard full body um, with 400 yard eye shine um, and the batteries will last two to four hours on one charge. So they do have good battery life um, by themselves. You can, of course, charge multiple batteries, so that way you have backups in case you need them. I will put batteries in the other one. Um, I think this one is actually a red light, so we'll get to see the difference between the two as well. I knew I was going to do one of the batteries the wrong way. I'm really good at that. Someone has to do it eventually, right? Okay. Um, this one's a red light. Um, seems to have a little bit wider of a beam. And... Um, also, really, really bright. Um, lots of color. Ooh, creepy. Um, but I, like I said, I'll do videos on them later as well after I use them. Um, just letting you guys know what I think product wise. But right now, I mean, I think the setup's really cool. I think that being able to put, um, a light as your stabilizer is a really good option. So very, very awesome stuff in my opinion. Uh, Let's move on. They sent me one more thing that I wanted to share with you guys, which is um, their headlamp, which um, this one has a, um, I forget what color light it is. And it is actually really bulky in my opinion. Like it's, it's a pretty, pretty big headlamp, but it is really comfortable. Um, my only concern is that it, it, I mean, it sticks off your head pretty far. So if you're trying to move around or any, oh gosh, I look great. Um, if you're trying to move around or anything, you're going to, you know, kind of bump your head, but it is really stable. Um, it's not going anywhere. It doesn't feel like the light's moving. So, um, a little bit bulky, but it is stable and seems very easy to use. So I will do um, a review on all of this stuff again after I've used it and let you know what I think after that. So thanks for checking this out, you guys. Um, check out aloeash.com for our updates, uh, photos, prints, etc. Um, I'll also be posting on my social, uh, social media sites, so Facebook and Twitter. And check out Predator Hunter Outdoors um, for the cool products that I just reviewed. And I will let you know what I think as soon as I actually get to use them. Thanks, guys.